Here we go, seaside, here we come. And this is rather pleasant, isn't it? Easy, comfortable journey. 
Let's have a look at the figures. 95.5 miles. 84 mile left in the tank. 48.7 mpg. Average speed, 40. So let's take a walk through Prestatin and see what this beautiful little seaside town has to offer. Discount alcohol. Rather an imposing chapel. A local MP's constituency surgery. An empty shop with massive potential. All your fish and chicken needs taken care of there. It's rather cosmopolitan, isn't it? Nice cafe bar. Ooh, very splendid looking delicatessen. When the weather improves, that's an excellent opportunity for some uh, al dente dining. Another chapel. A vaping emporium. Opening soon. Lichgate there. Yeah. Lovely. In fairness, that's the first one I've seen. Seaside cat. Perfectly normal to my generation, but imagine bringing a sort of 13 year old American kid to a town like this and saying have fun there's a shop where you can buy buckets and spades there's a lady there bless her with a push chair I've seen her walking around quite a bit and there's no baby in the push chair it's a doll bless her made me quite moist And it started to rain. Ooh, it's rain. It's exciting, isn't it? And who wants this?
Well, been here for about 15 minutes and from what I can see on the net and what the honourable guidance lady is telling me, could be here for another hour. No idea what's going on other than roadworks, lane closures. <sighs> Fifty minutes and counting. I'm starting to crawl a little bit now. I think that might be because some people are coming off at this junction. Don't know whether to come off or not. And that's the hour. Total standstill. And I've got the low oil pressure light flickering on. Great. Take the exit, 10 M56, towards Warrington, then cross the roundabout and take the third exit towards Manchester. the roundabout and take the third exit, M56, towards Manchester. So what the sodding hell is the problem? Is it that bloody accident on the other side of the road? If all of that was down to bloody rubber necking. Jesus Christ. Looks like a truck's gone into a truck, gone into a bridge or something on the other carriageway. But I can't see anything on this carriageway. So if I've just been sitting for a bastard hour because a load of arseholes have been rubbernecking. Well, just about home now. So. Let's have some little sum ups on the day, which I've enjoyed. I have enjoyed it. The journey home, obviously a bit troublesome, but not the end of the world. Okay, uh, facts and figures, let's see. Total distance, 194.9 miles. Um, and probably add on another, oh, another four to five. So, it's going to be 200 miles by the time I get home. Um, I've got 44 miles of range left in the tank, the light, fuel light is on. I've put in 32 pounds of diesel, so at today's prices that's about half a gallon. So fuel economy being good. Uh, and on the subject of fuel economy, we've got a figure showing on the onboard Sinclair Spectrum of 43.4 mpg. Um, obviously I've got no idea how accurate or otherwise that is, but um, I've got to be pleased with that really, considering that it's going to be absolutely hammered by that hour we spent sitting on the motorway, um, some, not all of it, but some of it with the engine running. And finally, not that pay any attention to this, average speed 31.8, neither here nor there as far as I'm concerned. Okay, um, so let's talk about the
the car. This is my Henrietta Pi. It's the Roma 75 CDTI Tourer that I bought for £500 from London just a few weeks ago. And what a car! Wow! I mean, it's been fabulous. Um, okay, she flashed up low oil pressure while we were sitting in roadworks. Hasn't come up since. Obviously, I'll check the oil um, tomorrow. Check the check the level. Uh, see what the score is there. But she hasn't got a foot wrong. Um, the temperature needle has stayed absolutely 100% constant. Um, what an incredibly comfortable car to drive. I mean, it's uh, one of the ultimate waft mobiles. Lovely, lazy, five-speed automatic box. Cruising all day long at the legal limit at just a whimsy over uh, 2,000 RPM. Super, super relaxed. The seats are amazingly comfortable. Um, there are lots of toys to play with to keep you amused. Honestly, for a 500 quid road trip car, I don't think you can beat this. I really don't. Um, so, yeah, uh, absolutely fabulous. Um, talking about the car, I've got a slow puncture on the near side rear. Um, that's needing to be blown up every few days. It's a good tyre with really good tread, so I'm going to try and get that repaired. Um, there's the key saga that we know about. I did try to get one cut today in, um, in Prestatin, but they didn't have the right machine to cut it. But just what a fabulous car. What a fabulous car. Um, just goes to show that even for a £500 budget, you can buy something really, really worthwhile. Um, other than that, thoughts on the day. Um, a little bit sad, really. It's um, those were places of excitement many years ago when I was a boy. There were bright lights, there were excitement, there were holidays. It all looked rather grim. Uh, seen in today's life, the towns anyway. Um, the beaches are still beautiful, um, and when I said that just now, I was talking about um, I was talking about real, talking about pressed that in. Um, Talica bears no relation to childhood or anything at all. I've only been there once before, and it was at the very back end of last summer, and it was on a date with an amazing woman that I was head over heels for, and we just the most incredible evening and it's a wonderful place and it was very nice to I couldn't uh, drive past and not pop back there um, uh, I mean it is a nice place it's still a little bit tacky and I'm probably rose tinting it because I had an amazing day there so you know a bit of an emotional attachment to it but hey ho, it was it was nice to go there, and it's been a nice day out. Um, I hope you've enjoyed some of the some of the bits of footage. Um, it's been my first trip to Wales, home of this year, and God willing, there will be many, many more to come. Um, weather, not been too bad at all. It's raining now. Uh, got a couple of spots when I was in Wales. But it's been, I think it was 12 degrees when I left here this morning. It's a high of about 16. Um, perfectly pleasant, perfectly comfortable. So there we are. Thank you for your company. I hope you've enjoyed parts, if not all, of the video. I'm home now, so I'll say thank you very much and good night. Final figures.
198.6 miles, 30 miles left in the tank, 42.8 mpg, 31.9 miles an hour average speed. And I'm out of here. I need the loo!